Hey guys, welcome to Drinks Tube. I'm Sophia and I love beer. I love going around the city and discovering new beers, but there's absolutely nothing that I love more than chilling out in the park in the sun with some great summer beers. Today, I'm gonna to show you three of my favorite summer beer styles. So first up, we have a blonde beer. Blonde just refers to the color of the beer. It's really, really light. It could be a lager, it could be an ale. Now, blonde beers are really light and not too bitter, perfect for summer sipping. Today, we have Hiver, beer made in London with local honey. So you can see it pours a really nice golden color, lots of bubbles, just the right amount of head. It's a really nice, light, easy drinking beer, not too bitter, a little bit of sweetness from the honey, but not all too much. So next time you're out drinking in the sun, try something different, give a blonde beer a go. So for my favorite fruit beer, I've chosen Bluebus Maximus, a collaboration brew between two of my favorite UK breweries, Beavertown and Wild Beer Co. They used 1.4 tons of blueberries for this one batch, which, if you do the beer math, a specialty of mine, comes to this many blueberries per bottle. So all of the flavoring and all of the coloring in this beer is entirely naturally from the blueberries. So you can see it pours this absolutely gorgeous purpley color. And like I said, that's entirely from the blueberries. It's got a perfect amount of fizz, that is really good. It's got a lot of tartness, not just from the blueberries, but from a wild yeast strain that they use. And it's also brewed with bay leaves to give it just a bit of savory balance. So next time you're out drinking in the sun, try a fruit beer, make sure you get one with tons of natural fruit and you won't be disappointed. Last and certainly not least, we have a session IPA today. Now you've probably heard a lot about IPAs, India Pale Ales. They tend to be very high in alcohol, high in bitterness, and a very thick body. Now Session IPA takes all of that and makes it much lighter, so you actually can drink it during the day, thus Session IPA. So I've chosen Ska Rudy Session IPA. It's a 4.5% beer. It's really low in bitterness actually, and quite high in fruitiness from the hops rather than having a ton sort of sharp acrid bitterness. So you can see it pours a nice golden color, nice amount of bubbles in there, beautiful. So if you give this one a smell, you can kind of get a fruit hit right off the bat, and that's all from the hops. That's such a good beer, so gently bitter. Tons of watermelon, pear, sort of candied fruit flavors, almost like gummy bears in your mouth. So this is, you can see it's got a bit of haze to it too, so it's been left unfiltered. So next time you're out enjoying afternoon beers and you wanna have a couple, give a session IPA a go. There you have it, three of my favorite summer beer styles. Check them out next time you're drinking in the sun. And for more great ideas and recipes, check out Summer Drinks playlist by clicking here. Lastly, don't forget to subscribe to DrinksTube so you don't miss any videos from me, Jamie, or the gang. Cheers.